Hi, Kenneth. I'm going to, I'm just going to emulate your account. I'm going to download a copy of the product for Dreamweaver right here. And then I'm going to, uh, I'm going to have to just click these for you on your behalf, but you've already downloaded the product. So um, I'm going to uh, do this and open it up because I actually have Dreamweaver CC 2015 on my computer as well. Haven't heard of this happening yet, but let's, uh, let's see what's going on. I fear it may be a corrupt cache, but you just downloaded it the other day. So let's just uh, put this to the thing. Let's take the template here and extract it. Okay, like so. Now, what I have here is I'm going to take a look at the properties first. 6.56 uh, megabytes or uh, 6885, 376 size on disk. And we have a properties of uh, 8.98 megabytes. And the reason I did that is obviously just to make sure that if the file didn't completely download, it could be a problem. But um, let's go and fire up Dreamweaver uh, apps here. There we go. Let's get this fired up here. Then I'm going to go and define a new site and see what happens. Okay, so just firing it up here. I'm going to let this thing load in, which takes forever, especially when I'm running video. But Okay, close that down. I'm going to go to uh, site, new site. I'm just going to leave it unnamed and go to my desktop here and breeze through all the junk where I have. Or there we go, and in and in. So we've got... Layouts, website templates, and folder website down here. And the last thing in the list up here is websites. So I'm good. Select and save. Okay, so let's get into the index page. I would expect that I can open that up. Um, and here's the thing with uh, fifth CC versions is make sure that you're in the not in the live mode. I've seen other folks with this and right trying to edit the page and whatnot. Um, Put it into design, okay, and uh, we don't want split, we want design, like so. Okay, so let's do that so far. All right, uh, here's some ah, some updates, da, 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 save, and it's saved. I'm also going to view visual aids. I'm going to hide them all. I don't need all that stuff on. So, so far, so good. Not crashing on me yet. Um, library, footer, copyright, uh, 16, because we're almost there. Update, and let it run through its thing. Then I'm going to preview the page. I can see the index page has already been updated here. Close, bang, and... Uh, 2016 right there. Let's just uh, save and preview. And there it is right there. And it's updating. So no crashes. Okay, so what I'm going to suggest, two things. Okay, because I'm not able to get it. I'm just going to reread your ticket first, though. Yeah, I went just went through to reread your ticket to make sure I had the right sequence of things that we were doing. So there's the primary. You said you're able to open that up rename it or save it as index and then save it over the index then it worked fine after that my thought was this that when the site was first defined right when you first define a site it creates a cache in your computer what i found is let's say you've um, used the same sort of name for that cache for that template before or for if you have a common place on your computer where you put your website files if it actually has the same folder name that may cause a problem what you may, what you may want to try is go and find where the website folder is copy and paste it like so and call it website 2 okay then go back in Dreamweaver and define website 2 as your new site because the folder name is different it creates a new cache and sometimes that's all it needs in order to fix that but I I haven't heard of this with anybody before, so like normally if something would crash, it would be, especially the Aura template, it's it's uh, been around for a while and quite popular, but I've only got CC 2015, but I don't imagine there'd be much difference between the 14 and the 15, but um, I'd say give that a try. Um, 
and see if that works. If not, I'll be back. Unfortunately, I'll be what Christmas. I'll be back on Monday. So, uh, but I hope that uh, that gets you through over that. Cause I'm just trying to duplicate the issue, obviously, and it's not duplicating for me. So, I'm trying to come up with another thought. That might be it.